Shortly after his appointment, the new chairman of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, Ola Olukayode, pointed his anti-corruption gun on the National Assembly. He told the lawmakers he would begin with them. The Nigerians trust his bravado, or believe it is what they called initial gragra. Join us as we hear the views. What are your thoughts on EFCC's proposed probe of lawmakers? He may meant well for this country, but they will definitely fight back to make sure that they rubbish him. Within a year or two, you see a lot of accusations here and there, trying to dispel whatever he wants to do. The likes of Okonjo uh, Iweala and all this uh, uh, during uh, Obasanjo, they did their best. But what is the effect of it today on this country? Are we better off? That when they tell us another thing, you see them doing a different thing altogether. That, that's where we say we got it uh, wrong with them. If he can do what he said, then we have a lot of applause for that. Bold move. Uh -huh. it's a, yeah, to, at, at, actually I see it like that. It's a bold move as well for him to at least say categorically to them that he's going to start the war. It's going to start the proving. It's going to start the, you know, the finding from them. It will encourage Nigeria that there is, there is still hope in this country. They are all the same thing. Both the member, not be there upon the EFCC chairman. So you have chairman, they are the ones that endorse him. So I don't think they are going to make any difference. The way this regime is going on, it's party party government. So you are not belong to this, you cannot get, get to the to the seat. It's just make Nigeria say, ah, they are going to make a difference. It's the same thing. They are the bed of the feathers. When you want to fight corruption, you yourself want to fight corruption. We still see some people who are still trying to fight for the mass. It's a great thing that he has for that motion that he has moved. If it's going to work with the motion, it's it should start from him himself. What of you? So if he can fight for this, it's very good. It's a great thing. It's not the first time that we'll be hearing even once somebody that um, has been appointed, newly appointed, even into elective office, you know, you want to even sound tough. You know, we have had it over time. So I hope it will not be a situation of even like even a toothless bulldog. You know, so but until we see it happen, we'll know that he's, yes, he's committed to doing it. So what I think, I, I don't really think he's going to come out as planned the way he said it because he's just trying to buy our conscience actually that's all I can say. I see it as a jamboree that's what I would say. It's just a mere film. It's just like Nigeria they are, they are just acting film like Hollywood. What we need in this country is that we need to tell ourselves the truth. We are just wicked to ourselves using religion and tribe to cover up. It doesn't I don't I don't believe in what they are saying. For more on voices from the streets visit ripplesnigeria.com without borders, without fears. Thank you.